What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, um, well, the Miami Dolphins won a game. Um, definitely got some mixed feelings about that. I mean, we're tanking, so it's kind of a weird feeling when we when we actually win a game. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get right into this. I'm going to be showing um, just some of, the, some of the good things that I can finally show you. I mean, I've been trying to stay... Uh, positive this season. We finally got a win, so I'm going to continue to do that. So, um, This first play, Preston Williams, he's going to be getting an easy touchdown. Now, unfortunately, he did also get injured in this game, and we are going to lose him for the rest of the season. That really sucks. He's really been showing himself, but um, what he's done this year has should easily guarantee him a spot on the team next year. So let's hope to see him continue to progress. Let's go ahead and get into this play. Slow it down. He's gonna he's gonna fake outside and come back in. And he's gonna get wide open. Just a complete hole in the zone. So I don't know if this defensive back thought that there was a penalty on the play. Maybe he thought that Ryan Fitzpatrick was already sacked. I don't know, because he just kind of stopped, so did the safety. Well the safety was reading him in the flat, but this corner just kind of stopped. But Eh, whatever. Easy touchdown in the back of the end zone. So, hey, let me go ahead and uh, find the next play here. Okay, so uh, this play here is the Devontae Parker touchdown. Let me go ahead and get right into this. He's right at the top of the screen, right up here. This is a pretty simple route here. Slow it down. Nothing real crazy at the line. Throws this back shoulder, and Devontae Parker makes a very good catch. And it's going to be an easy touchdown. Well, not easy. That was a contested catch. But let me show it from this angle so you can kind of see the catch a little bit better. Slow it down now. Mm -mm. That's, uh, this is the type of stuff that, I, that I've been waiting for. With Devontae Parker. It's the stuff I've been waiting for him to do more of since he was drafted. Um, I mean, this is his first year being completely healthy, and he's looking like a more valuable target. And now without Preston Williams, we're really going to need to rely on that. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and find the next one here. Okay, so this is the second um, Preston Williams touchdown. Let's get and get right into it. Go there we go. Pretty simple. Going right inside. Ryan Fitzpatrick delivers it right on time before the safety can get over to him. And easy touchdown. It, it really does suck, though, that Preston Williams is going to be missing the remainder of this season. He's been... He's been a, a real surprise for how good he was. I mean, it was I made a video about him before the before the season started when we first signed him. And I even said in that video I wanted to see what his hands were like. Um I was able to see his route running and his athleticism on film in college, but and I could see his hands too and they looked inconsistent, but which they have been in Miami as well. But the one thing I was saying is that his quarterback in college was terrible. So, and he was having to make these ridiculous catches all the time. So, yeah, I didn't blame him for dropping a lot of them. So, but I'm I'm a, I'm becoming a big fan of Preston Williams now for sure. Let me go ahead and find the next play here. Sorry, my uh, computer was kind of freezing up there. God damn it. Um, yeah, anyway, let me go ahead and get right into this. Uh, yeah, so this is the interception that uh, Sam Darnold threw. It was a pretty bad one. Um, yeah, let me just go ahead and... I'll, I'll even let this go full speed. This is more a bad play against the Jets than it was a good play for us. I mean, Sam Darnold... He had all the time in the world. He's outside of the pocket. He's being pressured. He could throw this away right now. 
but instead he's going to end up getting hit and going to try to throw as he's going down and throws an easy interception. Ugh. It's just, no. Just don't do that. Let me go ahead and find the next one. Okay, so similar to the last play, this is more a miscommunication on the Jets' part than it was really something that the Dolphins did. Watch this. Go ahead and slow it down. He's got his man in motion. Um, and I guess there's a miscommunication because the center snaps this ball before Sam Darnold is ready. It looks like the right guard here. Gives him the signal to snap the ball before Sam Darnold was ready. Someone someone was wrong there. Whether it was Darnold, the right guard, or the center. Someone someone made a crucial mistake and it ended up becoming an easy safety force. I mean, good job heads up football for falling on it by the Dolphins. But it was more just miscommunication on the Jets. So, yeah. Um, let me see if I can find anything else I really want to show. Okay, uh, so I don't know if we're going to win another game this year, so I figure I may as well show every everything I can here. Better enjoy it. So, yeah, I'm going to be petty enough. Yeah, I'm going to show our uh, chip shot field goal as well. Let's show it from the other angle, though, so you can, like, really see it. Yeah. I mean, I don't know how to break down field goals. I don't. I, don't, I, I, I can't. I can't do that. You kicked it real good. It went straight. Good job. But seriously, though, I do like Jason Sanders. Though I, I, I don't. I, I'm, I'm just joking. But uh, yeah. Anyway, I think that's probably going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I would appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.